Ever wondered what microscopic dangers could be lurking in your garden soil, threatening your beloved canine companion? Picture this, tiny eggs, so minuscule they're smaller than specks of dust, lying in wait in contaminated soil, ready to be unwittingly swallowed by your dog. These eggs, once ingested, hatch into larvae, setting off on an incredible journey through your pet's body. For puppies, these parasites can start their life cycle even before birth, passed down through the placenta, or milk, from an infected mother. Adult dogs, on the other hand, can pick up these unwelcome guests from contaminated soil or feces, even their own, or from infected prey like rodents. Inside your dog, these larvae grow into adult worms, some reaching up to 12 inches long, making themselves at home in your dog's intestines. While they may seem harmless, they're anything but. These parasites steal vital nutrients, affecting your dog's health and development. These microscopic invaders can cause significant harm to our furry friends, often without us even realizing it. While these parasites often operate silently, there are signs that could indicate a worm invasion. As we journey further into the world of Ascariasis, it's important to recognize that this invisible enemy may give us subtle clues to its existence. Let's start with our puppies. These little bundles of joy may be harboring more than just uncontainable energy. An infection could manifest as a pot-bellied appearance, a result of a heavy worm burden. Persistent coughing, vomiting or diarrhea could also be telltale signs. Unexplained weight loss or stunted growth despite a healthy diet might indicate that the worms are stealing essential nutrients. A dull coat and lethargic behaviour may also hint at an underlying worm problem. Moving on to our adult dogs, they too can be victims of this silent threat. The symptoms can mirror those in puppies but are usually milder, making detection even more challenging. However, if the larvae migrate to the lungs, they can cause pneumonia, manifesting as difficulty breathing. The key here is vigilance. While Ascariasis often operates silently, its impact on our dogs can be significant. It's like a quiet burglar, sneaking in and slowly stealing the health and vitality of our furry friends. Early detection is crucial, but it requires a keen eye and a thorough understanding of these potential signs. However, don't be disheartened. Remember, these symptoms are not a death sentence. They are merely indicators that your dog might need a little extra care and attention. And with the right knowledge and action, we can combat this invisible enemy, ensuring our canine companions lead a healthy, worm-free life. So keep an eye out for these signs. Pay attention to any changes in your dog's behavior or appearance. And most importantly, maintain regular vet checkups because sometimes the most effective weapon against an invisible enemy is a well-informed ally. Understanding these signs is the first step towards protecting our dogs from this hidden menace. We've recognized the enemy and now we're equipped to fight. In the next scene, we'll explore the path to a worm-free life. So stay tuned and let's continue this journey together. Fortunately, diagnosing and treating roundworm infection is relatively straightforward. A visit to the vet can set you on the path to a worm-free life for your canine companion. The process begins with a simple stool test. Veterinarians can identify the presence of roundworm eggs in your dog's stool, revealing an infection that might otherwise remain hidden. Once Ascariasis is confirmed, your vet will prescribe a suitable deworming medication. These medicines are designed to kill the adult worms living in your dog's intestines, allowing them to be passed out of the body naturally. It's important to follow your vet's instructions carefully. The dosage and duration of treatment will depend on your dog's size, age and general health. But remember, treating an existing infection is just half the battle. The real key to a worm-free life is prevention. Regular deworming schedules are crucial. Puppies in particular are highly susceptible to roundworms and should be dewormed every two weeks until 12 weeks of age, then monthly until they're six months old. Pregnant or nursing dogs also need special attention. Deworming before breeding and again late in pregnancy can help protect the mother and her puppies from infection. Even adult dogs aren't immune. They should be dewormed at least twice a year, more if they're frequently outdoors or in contact with other dogs. In the fight against roundworms, your vet is your best ally. Regular checkups can catch infections early before they cause serious damage. 
Your vet can also provide personalised advice tailored to your dog's lifestyle and risk factors. Don't forget, deworming isn't just a one-off event. It's a lifelong commitment to your dog's health. Roundworms are persistent pests, but with vigilance and regular preventive care, they can be kept at bay. In the end, it's all worth it. A worm-free dog is a happy, healthy dog. And that means more tail wags, more fetch games, and more joyful moments shared with your best friend. Regular checkups and deworming can keep our dogs healthy and worm-free. The path to a worm-free life is clear. All we need to do is follow it. Did you know that roundworms don't just pose a threat to our dogs, but to us humans as well? It's a bit unsettling, isn't it? But it's also a stark reminder of how interconnected our lives are with our furry family members. These pesky parasites are zoonotic, which means they can hop from animals to humans. It's not just about safeguarding our dogs, but protecting our own health as well. Roundworms usually find their way into humans when we accidentally ingest microscopic eggs from contaminated soil or dog feces. Children are particularly at risk due to their tendency to play in the dirt and put their hands in their mouths. Once inside a human host, the larvae can cause a range of health issues, from mild discomfort to serious complications. So how do we protect ourselves and our dogs? The key lies in maintaining good hygiene and taking preventive measures. Let's walk through some practical tips. Firstly, make washing your hands a routine, especially after handling your dog, playing in the garden or cleaning up after your pet. It's a simple yet effective way to prevent accidental ingestion of roundworm eggs. Secondly, keep your environment clean. Regularly scoop up and dispose of your dog's waste. This not only keeps your yard neat, but also reduces the chances of roundworm eggs contaminating the soil. Next, if you have children, it's time for a little lesson. Teach them about the importance of hand washing and avoiding contact with dog waste. It's crucial to instill these habits early on to protect them from potential infections. Lastly, regular deworming is essential. It helps keep your dogs worm free and reduces the chances of roundworms spreading to humans. Consult with your vet to establish a deworming schedule suitable for your dog's age and lifestyle. By taking these simple preventive measures, we can ensure a healthy and happy life for both our dogs and ourselves. So go ahead, deworm your dogs regularly. And remember, cleanliness is key to keeping our homes and our pets worm-free.